Western Conference Finals continue tomorrow night in Utah with Game 6 between the Trailblazers and the Jazz. Portland leads three games to two after winning at home in overtime last night. The Jazz played the entire second half without John Stockton after he was inadvertently poked in the eye on this drive by Clyde Drexler right at the end of the first half. Fortunately, the injury is not serious and Stockton will play tomorrow night. His attitude is he will go 100% without thought to the eye. But one doesn't know, you know, if, if there's still some blurriness, heaven only knows what, how that would affect your, your shooting or your, your movement, your, uh, the speed they play. It, it's potential that it could affect him. But I would, I would think not. So the Jazz will have John Stockton. They won't have forward David Benoit for either Game 6 or Game 7 if it goes that far. Benoit's father passed away earlier this week, and the funeral is scheduled for Saturday in Louisiana. Let's go now live to Clyde Drexler, who is looking forward to wrapping things up tomorrow night at the Delta Center. But the question, Clyde, is are you guys up to it? Uh, it's been a home series all the way, and you've lost 24 of your last 27 in Salt Lake City. I think we're up to it. It's just a matter of going out and doing the things that we do well. And if we do those things, we're going to give ourselves a great chance to win. In game four, they went to the line 55 times. And some of you guys complained, and you were one of them, about the quality of the officiating. Did you let that get in the way of your performance? And is it something that no matter how it goes tomorrow, you just got to block out? I think you're exactly right, Bob. I think we did let that get in the way of our performance. Uh, whether or not it was justified remains to be seen. But I think it's something that you just got to block out. Everybody has a job to do, and as players, our job is to concentrate on the game. And that's what we're going to try to do tomorrow night. Hey, Clyde, speaking of concentrating on the game, you guys had a lead in the game last night and coming back after the half. And with Stockton out of the game, it seems almost as though you lost exactly that. Your concentration allowed them to get back into the game. And you got it in overtime, but they were able to battle you to that overtime. Did you lose your concentration? I think there was maybe a little lapse of concentration, Quinn. But I do believe that Utah really raised their level of play. They were playing at a very high level. They didn't miss many shots. And, uh, you know, when a team is shooting the ball that well, they're going to make it tough on you. Clyde, thanks a lot. We apologize that this had to be so brief, but we're looking forward to watching you and your teammates tomorrow night against the Utah Jazz. And coming up next